Hello, everybody. Today is day 31 of the Messages from the Universe project. It's April, what is today? It's April 22nd. Today is April 22nd, 2020. Welcome and thank you for joining us. Thank you for being part of this project. My name is Julia Bernatsky. I'm the founder of Untamed Hearts. Before we ask to receive a message from the universe, I like to exhale. Exhale all the worries, all the noise, everything that is happening outside of us that doesn't serve us, any fears, any anxieties, anything negative. We're going to leave it aside, push it aside, and we're going to be fully present right here, right now, entering a white room and it's a place where we go to to speak to the universe to creator to our angels what do we need to hear today i got two messages let's send energy of healing and protection to everyone who needs it yes Yes, yes, and yes. What I didn't mention in the beginning is that one of my friends who is also a nurse in one of the New York's hospitals asked me to dedicate this reading to all the students, all the nurses, and all the doctors who came to the rescue. There's a lot of people who came from all the states in the United States and also from Brazil to volunteer and to help our medical staff and all the hospitals to deal with what is happening there right now. So things are getting much better because we have so many more people working in New York hospitals, young people, experienced people, everybody came to the rescue. And my friend Leah had asked me to dedicate this reading to them. So when we're receiving this message, let's send energy of healing and protection to everyone who needs it it's right on what we the what we can do to contribute to the healing is to stay home to wear masks to wash hands all those things to prevent virus from spreading is what we can do to contribute to prevention and to healing but also what we can do we can focus our thoughts because our thoughts are energy we can focus our thoughts and those people who know how to work with energy can do more than that but it, even by focusing your mind your thoughts on people who need healing and visualize that beautiful white light send sending it directly to them almost be covered be protected be surrounded by it so that's a, one of the like simpler simplest way to just focus your energy and forward it to people who needs it so let's send energy of healing and protection to everyone who needs it Thank you. now miracles start to happen when you give as much energy energy to your dreams as you do to your fears this is the third time we're getting this message and I embrace it. I believe in it. The reason for fear to be here is to warn us. When something is, is to be aware of, it's the fear's job to give us um, an alert, a reaction, and to be like, oh, I need to wear a mask right now. I need to wear gloves right now. It's not a good idea for us to getting together in places right now we need to stay home unless we're working out outside right unless we just need to grab food and come back home so that's the fierce job but other than that we need to say thank you and you've done your job and nothing else what we need to focus our, our energy on is our dreams our inspirations our creativity because this is the time. This is the time to create. 
even though it doesn't feel that way. But this is the time to innovate. This is a time to reconnect with your dream and allow your dreams to guide you. Thank you so much, universe. So watch, look what we got. We need to be set. We need to be sending energy of healing and protection to all that who needs it all over the world. So miracles start to happen when you give as much energy to your dreams as you do to your fears. Here it is for miracles. We need miracles. Thank you, universe. Thank you for this path for today. If you like this video and if you're watching it on YouTube, you can subscribe to our channel. You can give us a thumbs up. And if you leave us your comments, that's how I know that you're listening. And I see Scott is leaving a comment. The two wonderful messages. Thank you indeed. Thank you indeed. Those are amazing two messages. So guys, please take care of yourself. Please wear mask, wash your hands, keep the distance. Stay home for the time that you don't need to go outside. And please remember, there's so much more goodness in the world than the negative stuff. I'm sending you lots of love, and I'm going to see you tomorrow again.